Hello everybody, hello people, welcome. In this video, I will show you how I made this reggae instrumental only using sounds, stock plugins, and effects from Ableton Live 11 Suite. Let's listen to the instrumental first. A little disclaimer, I'm not a reggae producer. I will not go too deep in effects and mixing and how to play reggae music and all. So first, I start with the tempo. Here you activate the metronome and you can enter your metronome here or tap it. Then piano. The piano I use from Ableton is Grand Piano Equal Bright Solo. It sounds like this. You can change the tone of your piano, the reverb too. Really great sounding piano with real samples. All the instruments that I used in this project is all made with real samples. For the piano, I play it with my MIDI keyboard here. For those who don't have a MIDI keyboard, I will show you how to make your own chords and all. You create a MIDI track and after a MIDI clip, then you double click, you create your chords, duplicate like this with Command D. On the MIDI clip, you have the groove parameter. Click on the hot swap button that will open a set of grooves. Search reggae and there is two reggae grooves. I will take the straight one and here it opens the groove pool and you can add some groove to your robotic playing piano. Let's exaggerate the thing a bit like this. Before and after. It moved around quite nice when you don't have a keyboard. You can do it with everything. If you need more information, when you click on this triangle here, it will open the info view. Move your mouse on any parameters on Ableton and it will tell you anything. Now that we have our piano, let's move on to the skank guitar. For this reggae instrumental, I choose the guitar Soft Tremolo Room by its own. To get a good reggae skunk, I need a wah pedal. You tap wah in the search bar, so I choose the major wah. And here there's some parameter you can play with to get a good wah, and this is how it sounds. If we listen to both together. When it's done, I go to the organ to do the bubble organ. The sound I go for is basic tone wheel organ. Together with the piano, the guitar. When I have my piano, my guitar, my organ, I move to my drums. The drum I choose for this one is the key piccolo snare. There's three or four packs here that have uh, real sounding drums recorded. And here I got the drums here. This is called a drum rack where you can put many instruments and you can change all those sounds. Here with the hot swap button, you can make your own drum kit. Double click on it, it will open more parameters that you can play with to get your own sound. Also in the drum rack, you can put some effects. Here I put a reverb and a delay. So now when I got my drums done, I moved to the bass guitar. In Ableton, there's a nice uh, bass guitar sound called the electric bass. There is slide, some glide, some slap. Now let's listen with the bass. I will say I have my core done. I will have my ear candy and in reggae music is the percussion. I choose the percussion core kit. There is chimes, vibra slap, kabasa, conga. And this is how it sounds by itself. Let's listen with the percussion. And after, I had some brass from Ableton, it's the brass ensemble. Here it's how it sounds. So I had an OTT. I had a tool for the intro, some laser gun. I added a guitar mute too. This is the guitar mute sound without amp and the cabinet. And now with the two effects on it. And that's done. The instrumental is done. I put my voice on it. I sing a little thing quickly. I will try to do a little mix and mastering as usual. And I hope you will like it. Thank you for watching again and peace.
every day It makes me Come on and sing Reggae music that's fantastic 